Welcome to the Grotto Tavern, widely known as one of Malta's best restaurants. Located in the old city of Amdina, this restaurant boasts an impressive feature that very few can say they've tried. Fine dining in a cave. The restaurant offers a limited yet delicious selection of cocktails. We were told that the luscious martini was the most popular cocktail and well, we could see why. In terms of food offering, the restaurant offers two menus. The first menu is a seven course tasting menu, which the whole table must have, while the second menu is the grotto experience, which includes five total courses, of which three are left for you to decide. We opted for the five course menu as we had some specific dishes that really appealed to us. We started off with some delicious Maltese bread, accompanied by a selection of dips and some starters. Included in these starters was a profiterole-like item filled with chicken liver pate, along with fish cakes. I must say that the dips were the perfect accompaniment to these items. Now onto starters, where we each chose a different dish. Our first dish was the fish of the day, which was a snapper accompanied by octopus tentacles and ponzu. The presentation was amazing and it tasted just as good as it looked. As rabbit is a staple dish of Maltese dining, we also had the rabbit covered with a solid garlic puree, which also tasted great. The last dish we tried was the Jerusalem tart with homemade cheddar cheese cream with truffle puree and slices of truffle. Now onto mains. The first main we ordered was the beef sirloin, which was cooked just the way I like it and served with a side dish of delicious mashed potatoes. This was probably my favorite dish. However, we also went for the lime called fish, which was also great, but it was a bit of a lighter offering than the beef. And of course, the best part, dessert. The dessert here was truly unique, incorporating some crazy ideas that had never even occurred to me. I must say, the menu frightened me when I saw mushroom for dessert. Spoiler alert, it wasn't really mushroom. The mushroom had chocolate mousse on the top with a white chocolate stem. The real mushroom part of this dish was actually the truffle sprinkled in with the dark chocolate soil imitation. This tasted amazing. We also had the aubergine, which was covered with a white chocolate topping. Yes, that is right, it is not cream, but actually white chocolate. However, my personal favorite dessert was the honey and fig deliche, which was served with pecans and honey parfait. All three desserts were great. Following dessert, we were served the Petite Four, which included a nice chocolate and a Turkish delight-like snack. I also opted for an Earl Grey tea to cap off my meal. A little extra add-on to mention was the bunker actually located in the restaurant, which was used during World War II by the British. Now it is used to store kimchi, but you can actually access it through the restaurant. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to check this place out if you visit Malta, and of course, don't forget to subscribe.